Jay LeBron, how are you doing? Chicho, I didn't get called into work yet. Open that box. Oh, dude. <laughs> how you doing, LeBron? Okay, gang. I'm scrolling down. We got an unboxing to do. Uh, Fedo was a good fighter, but I think you uh, could take him. <laughs> I don't think so, brother. I, I, would, I, would, I would just talk to him and sit down and have some. By the way, my snack, I made a lot of applesauce this year. Okay, this is two different types of apples, and they're fantastic. So I've been eating a, where we've been eating a lot of applesauce. Look at this pink color. I'll show you guys when during the day this as well. It's beautiful. This one is sweeter than the brown color one. I made like four batches. Chinese Communist Party, CCP. Gang, I'm all the way down to the bottom. And today is October 30th. Okay. And boy, how are you doing? Let's go. And um, about a week and a half ago, a couple of weeks ago, uh, LeBron, LeBron, is it LeBron? LeBron. LeBron contacted me and said, Chicho, I love your work and stuff like this. Can I send you a gift? And I said, look, um, sure, but make sure it's kosher and stuff like this. And he said, yeah, it's a board game thing and you'll love it. It's related to Axes and Allies. And I said, listen, I have Axes and Allies board games. So if it's a board game, you know, give it to someone that... Um, hasn't played the game and introduced them to Axis and Allies because it's an amazing game, right? And if you guys don't want to know what we're talking about, uh, I'll have links in the description of this video. Uh, I've shared a board game information and showed my board game collection three videos, and we did other board game stuff. And at some point, we're going to make an uh, introduction to how to play Axis and Allies board game as well as diplomacy, okay? And probably Avalon Hill games with squad leader and whatnot. I love to read those instructions again. And he said, it is, but you'll appreciate it. So I said, sure. So he sent it to us. <laughs> LeBron, he didn't tell me what he was sending, by the way. Okay. So, yes, I got the notice. I, I set up the streams on Thursday night, I think. The schedule for the streams or Friday morning. And then later, a couple hours later, I got a notice that, oh, package had arrived. And I was really busy Friday, so I had to actually cancel a student, delay a student, and walk to the post office and get this package. Okay, and I thought it was going to be a small package, so I walked there. <laughs> when I got to the post office, I gave them the code. I said, can, can you please give me this? And they said, uh, LeBaron, not LeBron. a French name. Ah, LeBaron. Okay, LeBaron. Awesome, LeBaron. So he said... Uh, the the post officer says sure, sure I'll go get it, and I'm I'm just going to do to do to do to do to do to do. And one of the post office people working there, I had actually given him Eye for an Eye comics. He's a comic book collector too, and I mentioned to him like a couple of years ago that I published comic books, and uh, he said, oh I collect comic books. I said, whoa wow cool. Da, 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 da. That's when we were or last year I guess when we we're sending out the packages to people, of winning comic books that we did for auction and I gave him some eye for an icon because we started talking and then this little lady the post office comes out with this gigantic box I'm like what the hell check it out <laughs> look at this thing right so it comes out with this gigantic box and I'm like oh damn I walked here <laughs> So she's like, "Oh, you walked here," and I picked it up. It wasn't. It wasn't bad. I, I've been working out, <laughs> so I'm. I'm in not bad shape. I'm okay shape, right? So I carried it like this, put it on top of my head, did this, did this. So I brought it home just to make sure we had it. And I met. I messaged LeBaron to say, uh, "Listen, I didn't know. I didn't check with you when we could do it. This is when we're doing the live stream. So I'm gonna crack this open. Okay, let's put this out." Let's see what this is about. And LeBaron, thank you for the gift, brother. Okay. Damn, that was uh, must have cost. Dude, <laughs> I messaged LeBaron. I looked at the cost of the shipping. Uh, it cost ill something just for shipping. It did. I looked at the cost of the shipping. It was $80 US to send it to me. I was like, I messaged him. I go, dude, you spent eighty dollars. You wants to send it. He goes, he, and he said, what did LeBaron say? LeBaron, what'd you say? Uh, he said, oh, that's just, uh, uh, 
it, 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 oh, I forget what it said. It said it cost a little bit more than that. So I was like, oh, damn, man. Let's check this out. <laughs> Lots of bubble in there. <laughs> That's a big old box, indeed. <laughs> Nice. Oh, oh, Pacific. I don't have this, dude. <laughs> awesome. I've been meaning to pick this up, dude. I don't have the Pacific. Pacific 1940. Dude, I didn't even guess it. I didn't even guess it. Check this out. Awesome. Awesome. Hold on, hold on. Let me... Oh, what's the back one? There's another one in there. What, dude? Hold on. Hold on. Okay, I gotta put this one away. Wait, wait. Let's take a look at this. <laughs> Compatible with... Check this out. Check this out. Check this out. I'm gonna read this. Compatible with Axis and Allies Europe 1940. Is that the Euro... Okay, I gotta check this. Check this out. Damn. Axis and Allies Pacific. Uh, here, I'm reading this little description here. Okay, I'm reading this little description here. I said it'd be totally... Oh, dude, totally worth it. Axis and Allies Europe 1940. Axis and Allies Pacific 1940 can be combined with Axis and Allies Europe 1940 sold separately to create the greatest Axis and Allies experience today. <laughs> Dude, my gaming group is gonna go insane for this. What the F? Both game boards unite to create a massive 70 by 32 inch playing field that will let you experience the full scale of World War II global combat. <laughs> Oh, dude, fantastic, brother. Thank you very much. Very, uh, read the letter, explain, uh, read the letter. I don't see the letter. Okay, I, I think I opened it from the bottom up. Uh, okay, let me put this aside. Uh, we'll, we'll take a look at this in another live stream. Crack it open, because I don't have this. We don't have this. The gaming group, we've talked about it, but we've never, because we just kept on playing Axis and Allies of Diplomacy and stuff. <laughs> check this out check this out europe 1940 axis and allies phenomenal phenomenal we will definitely be cracking these open and taking a look at them and let me see if i can find the letter let's check out the letter man oh yeah i opened it up upside down let's check out the letter chicho Let me put the bubble wrap away just in case the kitty cats, they're sleeping right now, wake up and attack it. Let's check this out. Wow, this is a long letter. Let's check it out. Let's check it out. Dear Chicho. Ooh, look at this. Oh, let's read this. Let's read this baby. Awesome. It's uh, one and a half pages. It's got some uh, stuff going on with it. Woohoo, Cheryl says. Awesome. Awesome. A gang, don't forget, don't forget, super important, super important. We love board war games, right? I love them since I was a child. I loved war games, right? Axis and Allies, I started playing when I was like teen, like early teens, right? Phenomenal, always loved it, always loved it. But in real life, war sucks, right? That's one of the reasons we have to free Assange, free Assange, free Assange. Julian Assange is a publisher and journalist that has been crucified for revealing war crimes committed by war criminals in our societies. Okay. They are trying to persecute him, crucify him. For more information, see wikileaks.org, defend.wikileaks.org, or our Julian Assange and Wikileaks playlist on 
sensor tube. These things, these these guys are brand new, void. Like they, they're like brand new. Like there's no scratches, dents. Like, dude, did you, uh, 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 LeBaron, did you buy these brand new? It, they haven't really been played. The boxes are like mint condition. I'm going to read this gang. Okay. Dear Chicho, I've been listening to you on sensor tube since about 2013. Wow. Wow. Seven plus years. Although I can, uh, rarely make a, uh, rarely make a live stream i still catch almost everything you post I'll, although i don't always agree with you uh, as you might say i quote i appreciate your perspective end quote i've ended up reading a number of books you have recommended and i have the complete set of monstrous now since you pointed it out how amazing it is awesome anyway ever since you posted your board game collection and rated axes and allies as a 10 out of 10 i knew you needed what's in this box uh it's nothing like the copies of aa that you currently have i've been playing aa since the 1990s also and continue to do so so whenever possible i continue to do so whenever possible it is truly an amazing social experience sitting down to scheme with your allies around the table indeed it is indeed it is inside you will find a copy of aa europe 1940 and aa pacific 1940 second edition they can be played separately however the real beauty is in combining them into global 1940 this gives you a 17 uh, 178 by 81 centimeter board um, versus 84 by 50 for the original so take that into perspective gang it's four times uh no it won't be four times the volume it's at least double double the uh, no volume area right 178 versus 81 to uh, no, it's it, it is it, no, it is it's pr approximately four times the area. So 178 by 81, right? That's that's what these two combine to, to 84 by 50 with the original little guy, if you call it little, right? Uh, versus 84 by 50 for the original, uh, with roughly triple the space, triple the space. Nice. It adds Italy, France, Anza, and. A N Z A C, Anzac, and China as uh, probable nations. Oh, what? I didn't know this. Probable nations, along with India, India British Far East Command, being a separate income from European UK. The game starts in 1940, prior to the fall of France, with a large number of diplom uh, diplomatic and income rules to enhance the historical feel. Oh, dude, dude, they are new. I'm not uh, about to send you some old used. Oh, dude, they are brand new. You could have sent me old ones, just so you know, brother it's okay but they're brand new dude 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 so hold on how many players can you have in this game so you could access knowledge you could uh, two you could play five so this would be like nine players you could do nine players with this no we gotta find more people to put in our gaming group. Added units belong to the original, uh, be, uh, beyond the original are added units. So there's multiple other units. Added units beyond the original are artillery, mechanized infantry, uh, tactical bombers, destroyers, cruisers, air bases, air bases, naval bases minor major factory oh, nine players <laughs> chaos is it nine players up to nine up to nine players cheryl cheryl oh man one day we will we will do this mods any of you guys 
and Cheryl, I think you play uh, Le Baron. You're in, <laughs> right? We do an Axis Allies game. Concepts added, convoy raiding, very fun as Germany. Convoy raiding, convoy raiding, convoy raiding. What would that entail? You should check out uh, Twitch's. You should check out uh, Tabletop Simulator. Though mods and workshops, you can get any board games for free. Some guy uh, even went through and made Panzer Blitz. Whoa! If you know what that Panzer Blitz, yeah, that's the one of the first axes and now uh, Avalon Hill board games we played. Panzer Blitz, I loved, and then we graduated to Squad Leader, and I still have the original Panzer Blitz we bought in the original Squad Leader. Six to seven players, about perfect. Yeah, yeah. So convoy raiding strategic bombing kamikaze love the kamikaze uh multiple hit uh, capital ship ships more that uh i'm likely forgetting very cool even with all this added if you have a group of experienced aa players you can be up to up and running very quickly i know you have uh, been playing aa risk style the past decade or so but i encourage you to use the standard scenario here for a while we have run it uh about 20 times in our group and it never comes out the way same way the number of choices you are presented with truly allows you to form your own unique strategy especially the addition of italy um co complicating the mad and china uh, the Mediterranean and China giving Japan some hard choices. Global 1940 can be played in one very long day. However, I recommend two days to keep it more enjoyable. Alternatively, if you have uh, space to keep it up, running it over about a month with people stopping by to take turns when they can is also good. I've played Squad Leader, Panzer Blitz, and many other excellent war games. None of them compared to this as far as social experience. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I cannot recommend it highly enough, and I'm excited for you to experience it. I work in uh, Oregon, um, Oregon Donation on Call. Or um, Oregon, um, Oregon, Oregon donation on call. So it is difficult to make live streams. But if you give me a heads up on this unboxing, I will try to be there, brother. Man, thanks for being. Oh, Josh, thank you, man. Uh, P. Uh, P. S. I also love dip diplomacy, and you should really get Hero Quest out. It's a gem. Oh, dude, dude. <laughs> for sure for sure uh convoy rating i i.e battle with atlantic subs taking uh away income subs taking away income okay i gotta look into that i gotta look at that fantastic brother awesome 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 thank you very much LeBaron. thank you very much whoa I'm gonna send this. I'm gonna cut this little section out and send it to uh, my gaming group and uh, try to set up a game. And for sure, we're gonna do, we're gonna play the official rules. The only reason we play Axis and Allies, the risk stop, uh, doing our own thing, because we've played so many iterations of the setup, the original setup, that we were like, okay, let's try this diplomacy style to a certain degree, right? Risk and diplomacy merge it together and. Uh, play it right so but this this and i've just so you know i read about this uh many years ago looked into it but we never pulled the trigger uh because we just couldn't get the commitment uh to go that hardcore with it so many years ago i looked into this and i thought about getting this and i talked to my gaming group but then we just kept on doing our gaming nights right so for sure the next game we play i might get them to come here and uh i can get at least two of them coming so maybe we'll i'll get them two of them coming here 
uh, for a weekend. We'll set it up like uh, Monopoly and play it and run through it. We'll see how what we can do. Would love to do this. Wow, wow, wow. The Kez LeBaron making the rest of the viewers look bad too. No, uh, it's we do we do to our capacity. Uh, we do to our capacity, gang. Uh, this is this is just about love, and love is about the capacity. You cannot undo undo uh, on that level. This isn't. Uh, the wall street model who can make more and stuff like this who can contribute more this is about just participation um this is about uh just pleasure this is about sharing the human experience this is not uh our current political economic system okay this is about real life so LeBaron, brother, thank you very much. As one gamer to another, uh, just reading this, I, I know you're, you guys are hardcore, man. Wow, I would love, it would be an honor to sit down uh, on one of your gaming group nights uh, to play with you guys, really, really. Hedgy this talk reminds me of your board game video yeah it just brings back the pleasure man uh, it's amazing it's amazing twitch is fraud also if you play magic the gathering you can play for free through program called uh cockatrice okay i don't know the kez i was just kidding i enjoy your reaction to this gift indeed i wasn't expecting this I, really i was not expecting this I didn't know what I was expecting. It was like Axon Allies. Cool. <laughs> Anything Axon Allies. Awesome. And hello, Heji. How are you doing? Uh, LeBaron, glad you like it. There is a even more epic and uh, complicated version that starts in 1936. Whoa. We can talk about that another time. Haha, <laughs> indeed. Let, let me get a little experience in this baby. <laughs> so cool man so cool so cool fantastic wow my head's spinning a little bit very cool very cool and thank you for popping in and thank you for popping in uh lebaron you do you you're doing an amazing thing like the work that you're doing wow and the stress raw level must be insane uh, we need little bit of nourishment applesauce homemade applesauce gang we picked a lot of apples this year a lot of apples the brown one is less sweet than the pink one and during next month i think we're going to do our little auction for uh, redeeming uh, channel points and i'm pretty sure we're going to put up some applesauce and the pink one is beautiful color you this it, this lighting doesn't do it justice but it's beautiful <laughs> the bear and his reaction is everything i hoped it would be it, it, like yeah as a gamer this it, this is amazing right it's amazing hedgy I'm having some apples at the moment. Well, sort of. Mm, what kind of apples? Oh, I know what you're doing. You're having apple cider. <laughs> awesome. 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 Ha <laughs> ha. Gang. That was a nice little break from the chaos of the world. I'll dive into this any day. Look at this. <laughs> oh, look at this. Look at this. Oh, look at that. Europe. Right. I think what we'll end up doing is probably playing 
um, one and then the other and then playing both at the same time. A lot more instructions than uh, axes and allies. Uh, LeBaron, I have to go to bed because I'm on call all weekend. Let me know when you are going to open the game. Indeed, indeed. There's nothing we're going to punch open. Look at this. All of these are board things. LeBaron, thank you very much, brother. Appreciate it. And for sure, we'd be in touch. We'd be in touch. Cheryl says good night, the Baron. Doctor B. Chicho, do you have a favorite automobile? Automobile. Uh, you know what? I've I've had the automobiles that I have. My favorite are the ones that I've driven. Uh, Lenault Le Car, one of the crappiest cars you could ever have, uh, but I loved it. It was amazing. Uh, I loved the Honda Civic CRX. Absolutely amazing. I love Nissan Pathfinder I've had. Absolutely amazing. Nice. No, I'm just, I'm not going to do anything else, LeBaron. You go to sleep. I'm going to put this back. But brother, go to sleep. You're on call. Uh, your work comes first. I'm putting this away. I'm not cracking it open. <laughs> Couldn't resist. <laughs> I would, I would, I would like literally spend like hours going through this right now, but no, 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 we close it, we close it. LeBaron, go to sleep. Go to sleep. Phenomenal. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Gang, let's talk politics. Let's talk current events. Let's talk about whatever we want to talk about. Sweet dreams, LeBaron. Spencer. Seeing Chicho's reaction to that makes me want to find out what the hell is up with this game. Pfft, amazing. Do so. If you guys have never played Axis and Allies, do so. It is important. It should be part of our education system. Every, every school, every school, in my ideal school, I would have a board games class every year in high school. I would start from K1, grade 1 all the way to grade 12, Every year you have board game class, uh, right? And in high school, grade eight, one class all year, goes all year, where you get together and play board games. Grade eight, grade nine, grade 10, grade 11, grade 12. Grade 12 would be diplomacy. Axis and allies would probably kick in. Uh, risk you would introduce early on. Axis and allies would kick in uh, sometime in the high school, right? You could play Dune, Avalon Hill games. Uh, but personally, uh, you, sh you would have a board game room and get people to play whatever board games they want, right? They just have to form groups and play board games, right? But every year, mandatory. Uh, not mandatory. I don't like the mandatory. Only English and math mandatory, but every year. 